I'm not going in the cave right away. Yeah. So I'm just putting my crafts on because that's easy. Hey guys, oh, we're at Crystal. We you better not pick one like right away. Yeah, well, please I'm don't. Not on. Let's speak on. Yeah, Let's please don't. On. Usually there's always like buses here, guys, but now there's like barely any buses here. Oh, my legs! Oh, people here. Oh. Yeah, like, yeah. I mean, there's, like, there's, there's old, there's mainly buses here for the past two years that we've been here. What's up, dude? There's only. Uh, there's been buses here for, for the past two years, and there's no buses, guys. Look at that. There's and there's no like buses. barely there's anyone no here. Yeah. But there's been like big school buses, like the really big ones. There's been like three or four. Like for the, the past long two buses, years. the long buses. Yeah, the longer ones for the past two or three years. Yeah, this is our and third year three here. Or four. This is our third year. And like every. So like I'm surprised, and, there's, and like the parking lot is usually filled. You know? Yeah. It is not even close to being filled. What she's saying, guys. It's really weird. I mean, look at that. Look how empty it is. Yeah, it it's is pretty so empty. Weird. I wish we were going to bring it back. Like, why wouldn't we? We have, we have access. We have access to a key now. Yeah, I got the keys. Look at Okay, so the bus is an active learning center. Yeah, I don't think it's anything, though, because it's a little school bus. It's, not, it's like the tiny one, not the big ones. And um, we're going to the car so I can get my sneakers on because I wore Crocs. I'm also getting my Sprite, too. And I wasn't so. that smart, and I didn't put sneakers on when, right before we got here because uh, my brain is on double vacation. So my vacation and my week of vacation. It's also our last week, too, so... We have one more week until school starts. So I'm super excited. But there's cars coming now. I'm like, no! It's like, and first there's like barely any, but now there's like a lot now. Yeah, people are coming in now. So I think we have to go a little bit low term now because we having those big. Can't be having those big ones. Wait, Ryan, stay here with me. I gotta, I gotta go. I gotta go back from recording. I had to pause it because I was pulling up to the TV. Sorry, there was like there's people by us, so we had to, I had to That's stop. That's sponsored. Riley didn't have to because he was on the other side, but he's lucky. So I'm gonna also crawl over and get my cave <laughs> because I did not think ahead and put my water or my Gatorade back with us. He brought his sprite because he came in the court after. Can you untie this other one, please? Fine. Excuse me. Oh, nothing. What do you say? Sorry. What? So. Sorry, what? Sailor. Is my face Oh, it's... Yeah, oh, it just looks dark. I think it redid itself because I think it accidentally stopped, but that's okay. Um, so our tour is at 11.30. I'm so excited. Ah! This is our third year. Yeah, I love going here. Even though it's the same thing, like, every time, it's still really fun. We enjoy it. All right. The first year we went, we did the fossil. Then uh, we did the gems. gems. And then last year, we, we did, did the, the fossil Because the, the first year, they didn't have it. But then the second year, they had both. And we didn't know. So this year, we have to make yeah. sure we grab the gems. Yeah, this year, I didn't even wash off my gems from Monday. Yeah, did I? I posted it this morning. Sorry, you guys. It is Wednesday, day three of Gamma Week. I didn't post. I didn't have anything for yesterday. I did. I didn't. I didn't make anything because I was just I was just doing something, and my mom watches my channel, and this is a surprise. So um, we have so I posted that this morning because um I couldn't post it la yesterday last yesterday because um last yesterday um it makes some sense. Because we should um, probably get back out. Hold on, I gotta get my drink. I gotta drink my drink. Duh. But, Duh. Mm -hmm. How? Um, but like. She, she's weak, that's why. Shut up, I am not weak. These, some of them are just hard. We fight like brothers and sister. We are brother and sister. Yeah, sure. Right at my face! Dude, that was literally at my I eyes. Okay, that was not at your eyes. I am... Thank you, dude. Yeah. Thank you. Whatever. Okay, now there's like a lot more people. Oh, that's a janitor. There's a janitor? Wait, Wait, there's a janitor? 
Wait, never mind. That's not the janitor. That's not the janitor. Never. If you if you do get a um, license plate, make sure you blur it out. Thanks. We don't need it yet. We're gonna do the obnoxious thing we did last time. Wait, I can't. Let Hold on. Well, I'm also kind of. I'm using my mouse right now, Riley. And I'm using a tripod right now. Three, two. Wait, hold on. I won't. Oh, you did it yet? I just gotta take it all out. Three, two, one. Crystal Cave. I don't, see any, I don't see any police here. Here's one of the signs. Crystal Cave. It's a and now there's a bus coming. Oh my gosh, there's a small bus. But I'm not worried about the small bus because it's usually really big ones. Yeah. So, I think we got here early enough where there won't be really big ones yet. Definitely. I think it's starting. I think they come a little bit later though, Riley. I think we'll yeah. get here at like 12. Oh, shoot, my alarm. Who knows? Hi. We're gonna aim for Riley, right? Where's your wrapper? Pocket. In the garbage. Here's your keys. I wanted to keep them. Sure. Please let, hold on. It's not scrunched up right yet. I'm going to prop you. Will you stand? Probably not. Okay. I don't know how it's going to look, but it's standing at least. I'm just going to make it. Molding it into its ball formation. I got it. Sorry, guys. Are you ready? Oh, no. Okay. Here we go. Mess completely. I hit you. You hit me, but you also messed at the same time. Hey. Let's look up this. Um, long steps, Gamma. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna head up a while. Yeah. We can come up whenever. We'll be just well, walking. Well, yeah, we should. It might take her a little while because she's old, but. Yeah, but like, okay. when can we go? Because no one can drive. Well, I mean, you can't. But I think that's only for um. That's, no, that's the museum. No, that no, people can park there. Yeah, but I think that's really only for staff. Because there's a bunch of staff. Because there's a bunch of staff in there. There's guides. There's a bunch of staff there. There's, there's a bunch of staff. There's a bunch of staff at the um. Museum. Oh, I've got oh. Uh, your wallet. Your, your purse? Your man purse? Shut up. <laughs> Did you look at your man no, purse? No, I said, oh, I forgot how like, steep this hill was. No, how long this thing was. Look, I had to walk up something a lot worse than this because it was steep like this. I didn't record last night, though, with that. But I had to walk up. I had to walk a hill. I had to walk a five Shut mile up, hill. I'm talking. I had to walk up something so steep while it was raining on, with a backpack on and it was rocky and there were so many times I almost tripped. It was not funny, guys. And then we had to walk down because we we did the wrong one. It was very, we got there at the place we were going and then there was this tower that I climbed up a few times and climbed down. And then we went back. You and, and climbing up things. So it's ah, look up. I have to hold on to the handy rails. Right, even my three on. times zoom won't even fit. But she's so far. I had a full snack and it had grapes in it. I had grapes and watermelon. So I added some water oh. to it. Oh. Grapes and watermelon? Whew, I feel sorry for you now. But sort now, of. that was kind of hard. Oh, look, she's going to take me up to the stairs. Little old granny. But then. Maybe, was... I'll, maybe I saw one of you guys here and you guys didn't notice me. Who knows? Um, but like this is an hour long tour. It is. I think we're short. Mm mm. Oh well. So probably at least an hour and a half of this video, guys. Um. Yeah, I'm not gonna record the whole time like I did when when I with the other one I posted. That was an hour basically. Basically an hour, but my oh look at her. She's sitting down. Have to take a break and a breather. Because um, she's old. But like. Oh, remember last year? It was so there was a, like a whole bunch of group of kids like from there oh up gosh. all the way up to here. So last year, we were waiting like where she, where my, where our grandma sitting. Because your mother. Look at that. 
I'm gonna show you guys that um, sign over there. But also, it's like really crazy. So yeah. I'm trying to get historical pictures of the exit. That's where we exit over there. Probably the whole tour is going to be in this video, but not like the video because that's copyright. Yeah, we're not, there's a video that they showed in the beginning and we're not going to record at that time. It's like 30 minutes, so... It's not 30 minutes, it's like, it, well, it's close to 30 minutes, but it's not 30 minutes, uh -huh. but like we can't... Hey, they got rid of the bees' nest hose here. Yeah, I'm going to flip my camera around so you guys can like see my face and I'll have to hold it backwards. Like... If you're on Riley, if you are subscribed to Riley, you can see my camera in his mm -hmm. because I have it that way because it makes it easier for me. So I'm gonna pause it and flip it. Wait, I'm gonna hit it. I should I should have brought my other tripod. It's fine. Sorry, I had to flip that around, but um. So you can, you can hear the video playing in the background. Background's right here. Not yet, but like we don't want to like record the video because we don't want to have a copyright and everything yeah. because it would be copyright, but. So, and like, um, I walked, and then on the way down, I made my mom carry the backpack. Because uh, we went with friends. Yeah. I'll type it in for you later. Uh, we need to type in notes, so, yeah. Because it's sometimes hard when we're recording. <laughs> but, um, oh no, I stopped. Sorry, I stopped it. Sorry. Um, but, um, so we did that, and I was down with the other two kids from the friend. Group, stone. Yeah. Just say friends. That's yeah, the that's. Friends. What? I'm running. Running down. I just realized I forgot my sword. Oh, it's in the car. 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 Oh, it's it's easier to get lost. I'm not really lost, but another way. Sure? We I, I know, I know, I know. Who know this? Please keep off the bank. Wow. so yeah. Uh yeah, I'm gonna be back, like probably when we get back to the thing. Right after the video, so Um, I mean I'm obviously I'm gonna keep recording because why not? Um I gotta do this like part for a channel update. Alright, let's do some typing time. Cause Riley's recording. Guys, welcome back to another channel update. It's Riley and Stella here. What's uh, up? We, Sorry, I'm typing to him. We are, he's we are at Crystal Cave. Um, and our grandma's here. I'm on the phone. But, this is a channel update. This is a. Whatever. Now. This, right. is a, this is a channel update, guys. Um, so right over here, in front of Stella's head, we have did that many subscribers, guys. We keep gaining, gaining more. Thank you guys for getting me to this many subscribers. Um, more Gamble Week episodes coming out. Um, more more of the like gaming episodes posted two more this one and this one go check those out link in the description um tomorrow will be the last well don't really know to be honest um this should be a short one um due to copyright reasons um, I'm going to only be doing one live stream per week. This week has an except, 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 exception due to Gamma Week. Oh, yeah. Okay. Anyways, um, behind this, more behind the scenes of my studio channel right here. Coming out. Why did you take me? Elaine A. 
the only know if there's people coming. Wait, you said you're done. Okay. Uh, can okay, you stay on the it. line while Dude, I attempt to do that? Dude, I need to stop doing your gun. No, well, there you go. I still have my gun because I'm constantly chilling. Yeah, it's because okay. I'm constantly chilling. Okay, thank you. Finally got out the phone. Uh, oh no. Oh, I feel like it's you. I don't see anything. Did you guys right, stick around here? Yeah, sure. Oh, I kind of want to stay a little bit. Oh, because I hear them. They're out there. Oh, look, there you guys are. Right there. Um, we're gonna go look. That's only my mouth. I can't see. Um, oh, no. I, they're okay, out. yeah, they're definitely coming. You guys need to look at this. People are coming. I can't even see myself. How am I supposed to know? Yeah, some people are definitely coming. Definitely. I can't even see the screen. Yeah, they're looking direct. There's definitely people. Definitely. Man, so, like, wait, did we do mini golf last year? Huh? Here? No. Yeah. Did we do mini golf last year here? No, we only did that the first year. First year was, the, the mini golf here was kind of boring, I feel like. Yeah. To a girl. Shut up. And just for clearance, she's my cousin. She's not my. She's not my girlfriend. She's my cousin. See, we even look alike. We even look alike. Sort of. It's disgusting. But come on, disgusting. People thought that me and Maddie were girlfriend. girlfriend. When she's pan. <laughs> that works too. Okay, Yeah. So, she, but even though she's still smarter than me somehow, when I'm in some kid, she's in six. He's a dummy. Yeah. He's a dummy. Wait, let me see if I can get it on. Oh my god, look at that. It's camera and camera and camera. Right, 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 right. I hate holding. It's just a wand. You hold it. See? It's camera and camera and camera and camera and camera and camera. Yeah, camera and camera and camera and camera. Ah! <laughs> You're so like. Remember when you hold my hand during when the, when the lights went out? No, I was doing that constantly on the road because it was creepy. I only do it because if I fall, then you fall. And then I get to laugh at you really hard. I mean, I'll be laughing at you really hard, too, so. You'll be on the ground. Must I pull your hair? No, is it pull your hair? If she can walk. What do you say? You gotta stop it. Sorry. What? Stella. Excuse me? Give me your hand. Give me your hand. Open. Hold on, I'm gonna put you back there. Stop it! I have all the unfootage. What do you say? Where's the Michael? No, I'm not. Excuse me? I would not look, I would not want to take that disrespect to the next level if I were you. Get your hand off me. Oh, buddy, you're like crowding. I'm on the very edge.
You're not really blocking me. No. Okay, guys, so we're heading into the cave. Um, I think we're the last one. Yeah. Oh, do you think you try that? That's new. The nature trail, that's definitely new. No. Thir yeah, three years. I'm going in. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Let's get the camera in the camera. The camera in the camera in the camera. Last two years ago. In this year. Last year. So, guys, we're about to enter into the cave. Oh, um, nice. Did you feel it? Did you feel it? Did you feel it? Here's the temperature drop now, and we'll come out. I'm going to get into the cave. I'm going to freeze. I forgot my sweatshirt. Mm -hmm. They're not going to get anything. Okay, we already have one of the rock formations. They should probably stand up there. Mm -hmm. yeah. Maybe. Oh, it's going to be cold. Poison? No. Oh. Did drop. It is a little, the temperature did drop a little bit. Mm. The temperature did drop a lot though, a little bit. Yeah, she has a point. With the spider webs. Look at the spider webs. That's not spider. That's not spider webs. Oh, right there. Yeah, that, that's one right there. Hmm. <laughs> And then it's starting to get dark in there. Not bad to know in gamble. Stop, stop, stop. Actually, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what was that? Oh, there you go, everyone. Who called me a 
You'd be fine. Ice cream? Ice cream, yes. We call this formation our upside down ice cream cone formation. Um, it kind of looks like someone's having a pretty bad day. They drop their ice cream on the sidewalk and they're looking out all over the place. Unfortunately, this is not ice cream. You can't eat this. You might bug a tooth and it probably would taste the best. It's called it drip, so drip stone. So water will drip these stalag tight up on the ceiling all the way down to a stalag height. Now the water, how stalactites grow is they eat water that comes through the earth and that collects minerals in the water that comes down from that stalactite onto our stalagmite is what helps our stalagmite to grow. But, but so now finally remember the difference between the two is that stalagmites cling tight to the ceiling and a stalagmite you might trip over. So watch out for those guys throughout the gate. So here we have our dripstone. He's all the way back on this far wall. We have our flow stone. So flow stone and dripstone are made up of the same stuff. Oh, but they're formed very different. Like it's like the water dripping down. And these rocks are actually flowing over, which will cause these formations to grow. Now you'll notice this one here is very really bumpy and rigid, and you can sort of see it's rotting away in here. Compared to these, which is a lot more smooth. And even back here, it looks a little bit like cinnamon bun frosting. Yeah. You know, it's white color.
Okay. Stop. Be careful. Gilmore definitely has to duck. It's probably still the same degree.
And it looks like a it looks like a cow too. Like look, you can see the horns and the things. Yeah, you can yeah, like little horn. No, look, no, right there. No, look. If you guys look right over here at this wall, you'll notice all this shimmering and shining. Feel free to get closer if you want a better look. So imagine you're one of the early farmers that found the cave and you had just the kerosene lantern lighting your way. How brightly this wall would have lit up. Well, when they saw this, they thought they'd struck gold because they thought they found diamonds. They thought they were going to be filthy rich and never have to work another day in their lives. So they broke off a chunk of this wall and they took it to a jeweler in Kudstown. Now we're in a cave, it's pretty dirty down here, right guys? Pretty dirty. So they had to wash off those rocks. However, when they went to wash off the rocks, they dissolved in the water. And obviously diamonds do not just dissolve in water. So these are not diamonds. These are six-sided calcite crystals and they are water soluble. They actually used to line the entirety of the ceiling in this room. Unfortunately, due to moisture here in the cave, they no longer do that. The reason why is because they have sort of a natural umbrella above them that shields them from any water droplets. Having about a spoonful of these is the equivalent to a spoonful in, of table salt in price. So these farmers definitely did not get rich from this, but they did sell the cave for about $5,000, so to get rich in a bit of a different way. The second type of crystal we have down here is right over here. All of the stuff that looks a little bit like coral is our aragonite crystal. I think this is the best chunk of sort of down here at the bottom. So some, some, some poor guys like to refer to this cave popcorn, but we have a lot of food names down here, and after a while, I just start to get hungry. Um, just by a little bit like popcorn, though. I like to call it cave squirrel, just because I think it's a little bit like coral. Um, so this is actually made of the same stuff as our six-sided calcite crystals. They're both calcite formation. However, their forms very differently. Rather than being water-soluble, these are only formed completely submerged underwater. These formations are a lot older than our other ones because they've been here a lot longer because it's been a longer period of time since our cave was ballroom as well. So they would have parties, weddings, hoedowns, and square dances in here. But if we were here a hundred years ago today, like I mentioned, we'd be walking in about a foot of mud and water. And I don't know about you guys, but if I'm paying a lot of money for a suit or a dress for a party or wedding, I don't really want that getting ruined in the mud or water. So we would lay down wooden planks all across this floor in here, and we would hang a wagon wheel from the ceiling up here with candles on it to provide a light source. Now keep in mind those calcite crystals would have been super pretty, kind of like a disco ball. Now if you're throwing a party and you want people to dance, what's something you need? Music. Music, right. So they didn't have Spotify or Apple Music. They couldn't just look up songs on YouTube back then. So they would have actual live bands come down here to the cave. And this is where the live band would play back here in this corner. And we actually like to say that the first rock band was formed. <laughs> it might have been the Rolling Stones, I'm not entirely sure. And then a lot of the times when I ask about something you need for a party, a lot of people say alcohol. Well, there was a period in time where there was alcohol served down here in the cave. That would have been served at a bar that was located right over here. Now down here in the cave, all the alcoholic drinks were served on the rocks. Um, however, I don't know why they chose to serve their drinks and snacks right here, because they have Devil's Den right next to it. Devil's Den is an 80 foot drop. So it's interesting, we're also not going to be going down there today. Apologize for your hopes up, guys. It goes down about 50 feet with a small landing, and then it goes down another 30 feet. Um, this is where our bats used to reside, however. We did use to have bats here in Crystal Cave up until 2016 when something called white nose syndrome swept the area. White nose syndrome is a fungus that grows around their face and causes them to not be able to echolocate. So unfortunately, we lost a lot of our bats here in Pennsylvania, and we entirely lost our bats here in the cave. We used to have around 60 to 80 bats living in here. Um, unfortunately, again, it's a white nose syndrome. They would come out during the winter when they're not supposed to be out, and they would unfortunately pass away. Fortunately for us, however, we have seen a rise in their population here in Pennsylvania back in 2023, and we have seen a few brown bats flying around down by the inn. We are just hoping they return to our cave sometime soon. The only reason we believe that they haven't yet is because we do have a lot of people coming in here daily. We're just hoping that once the season gets a little bit colder, they'll start coming back into our cave. Alrighty, does anyone have any questions about our bats? So like I mentioned, there were some weddings down here. So we talked about they had music, um, drinks, snacks, but another thing they needed is somewhere to stand when they're getting married. So right over here we have Altar Rock. 
Now, what if I told you guys Alter Rock is actually a stalactite? Well, if you remember when I said about stalactites in the first room, they're supposed to be on the ceiling. So they actually found this one way further back in the cave, and they cut it down and cemented it into place out here to serve as an altar for these weddings. Now, because there's nothing above it to feed it any minerals or nutrients, it's what we call a dying or dormant formation. You can see it's kind of chipping away in here, and it's actually hollowing from the inside out. Scientists believe that within the next 300 years, this formation will collapse down itself, and it's estimated to weigh about 600 pounds. Alrighty, so I've talked about all the things they use for these weddings. So naturally, do you guys want to hear about some of the weddings themselves? Alright, so the first wedding happened on October 15th of 1919, and we call this the wedding of Bridezilla. So this bride wanted a thousand pound grand piano brought into the cave for her ceremony. So she hired four men to do this for her, and those four men carried that giant piano all the way up that lovely hill you all walked up. And it didn't fit through the storage room down here. So they had to carry it up over this natural bridge all the way back to that corner where the bands would play. Now, uh, does anyone want to guess how long that piano was in the cave for? <laughs> Correct, not very long. Any specific guesses? Humidity. Mm -hmm. It was in here for five minutes. It played one song, the bridal oh. march. The bride was about to walk down the aisle and she realized, if I leave my piano down here, it's gonna get ruined. String instruments, humidity, they don't go very well together. So she made those same four men pick that piano right back up, carry it over this natural bridge, all the way back down that hill to the inn. Does anyone want to guess how much each man was paid? Barely anything. Barely anything, correct. They were paid 25 cents each. Oh, oh, yeah. They would be around $8. You guys going to help me move a grand piano to the cave for $8? 20 No? 20 All right, all right. This afternoon, I'm requesting you to help me move a grand piano to the cave. Okay. All right. Back then, 25 cents was also just free re-entry into the cave. So they did all that work just to come back in and watch the ceremony. Now, the second wedding in here didn't have such a great ending because the first one, they did end up getting married and they lived happily ever after, but the second one, not quite. So this was between two tour guides that met here and they thought they'd fallen in love and decided they wanted to get married in the place they fell in love at. Unfortunately, when they asked for permission, they were denied and they decided to sneak in after hours to have their ceremony anyway. Now, unfortunately for them, they were both caught, they got in a ton of trouble and they were fired immediately. Um, they also broke up about three months later. So it's safe to say that that marriage got off to a bit of a rocky start. Ah. <laughs> now keep in mind, you guys, this is a limestone cave, so don't take my jokes for granted, okay? <laughs> cool. Alright, now what if I actually told you guys we're standing in the most unsafe part of the cave right now? Mm -hmm. uh, I saw a good amount of you do this. Well, you'd be correct. If you look above you, we have our Blue Ridge fault line. So this line that extends all the way down the side of our cave. It's part of our Blue Ridge Fault System. So what this means is if we were having an earthquake, this rock over here would fall and crush us all. Lucky us, right? <laughs> <laughs> now luckily, we need an earthquake of a 6.5 or more for anything in the cave to actually fall, and a 6 or more to even feel anything down here. months ago in New Jersey is out of 4.8 and by the time it got up here it's out of 2.2. Now luckily for us because of the sediment in the area we're in we actually didn't feel anything here at the cave or down at the inn at all. There was one a few years ago I don't know all the specifics because I believe I was about three at the time but I know it was much worse and everyone was super super worried about the people up here in the cave because things were flying off the walls in the inn. When they came out of the cave they were like what happened because they didn't feel anything down here. So science has actually proven it's safer to be in a cave during one of those more minor earthquakes than it is to be outside or in a building. Unless, of course, it's a 6.5 or more, but those only, only happen like once every half a million years. We're coming up on half a million, however. <laughs> so I don't know if you guys want to move to the next room. I kind of do. I love my job, but maybe not that much. I need to be reversed and see you down here in the cave. Alrighty, right, before we head up, we can
currently if I'm really quick having something that eruption can cause severe earthquakes around the world, including Pennsylvania. Probably 5.8, 6.2, something like that. I can. It's called. It's called having the other hand. Okay, thank you. Kick someone with their head. They broke the wall. This thing's not safe. More bacon. Mm. We have some pussy turning ones. The bacon. Watch my head. Lights out. Lights out time. What? No, me Sam. And money. Yeah, there's I'm not There's dollar bills there. Got a little well. To stay in the so who's ready for a quick pop quiz? Yeah. <laughs> right. If you're out of the slides, you might not be able to see it super well. But does anyone think they can tell me what's wrong with this formation? What's it missing? The top. Yeah, correct. So there's no stalactite above the stalagmite to feed it. So it's another dying or dormant formation like the one we saw in the crystal ballroom. Now we call this sandcastle rock because as you can see, it's so dry that it almost looks like sand and it's kind of flaking away like sand. And so considering that same earthquake that happened half a million years ago, this rock shifted six feet away from its original positioning below the stalactite. 
like today. So that's why this is another diamond Now if you look at this edge right here, when I turn my flashlight off, you'll notice it glows a bit more orange than the rest of the formation. That's because that part has completely, ho completely hollowed out, so now light can pass through it. Then if you guys look straight back behind all of you, at this giant formation, Don't jump your water.
You did it to me, so. What? She blew my hair. No, I didn't. Not up there. You almost pushed me off and made me fall on to gamble. You pushed me. I didn't push you. Yes, I did. I didn't. Right, guys. Oh. <laughs> All right, you guys. So when you purchased your tickets for the cave, did they let you know we actually have a zoo down here in Crystal Cave? No. Yeah, we've got our very own Crystal Cave Zoo. So as you guys make your way down here, if you look right back here, we've got Sally the seal pointing her nose up in the air. <laughs>
Unfortunately for the time being, it's just the same way in as you can out, or same way out as you go in. Um, but we are hoping that one day you'll eventually be able to go out over there. But right now, it's not. It looks good to be a dragon down there. Is he, like, from a great heel, he is a bearded dragon. Mm -hmm. A dragon? You know, a bearded dragon. A bearded dragon. You can do animal now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, Alrighty, you guys. So we're going to be heading up the last set of stairs. Um, there is technically one more set of stairs after this, but let's just get out of the cave so we don't count that one. Um, after this, you can officially say you've survived the crystal cave staircases. Mm -hmm. The third time, Gimel. Maybe. <laughs> Oh, yeah. One year and five years. Nose is five, head is one. Okay. Oh, yeah, what's that, what's that, what is that smell? Okay, so we just completed Crystal Cave for the third time. Well, not her. But what's that smell? Okay, I'll get a picture of it. Yeah. I got a little bit of record on that. I got a lot of record. You don't think it's going to be like two hours? Uh, might be. Depending on how long the gemstone is. 
I'd be. Might as well be an hour. Ew. Hey, people were just sitting on here, so. Now, right here is a beautiful scenery, not gonna lie. Down that way. It doesn't look as safe. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Oh, wait a minute. Can you just wait? No. The is amazing. I know. Sorry, no but there's, def there's definitely amazing. something new. That black light was never there. Black light. Yeah, I don't remember that. Yeah. That's well, like, definitely brand new. Something cool. Here, like. I don't know. Like, it's gonna make um the he, he was the temperature outside and in the cave massive deep like massive drop i don't really know that much but all i know is that it was Another good experience. The black light was kind of new. Never. Here's a clip from, like, here's a picture of how black it was. It was pretty black. I'm just gonna tell you that right now. It was black. Um, the cave light what they used to use was cool. Like I said, they added new things, looks like. Um, definitely, I remember most of it, but the video, I think they may have changed a little bit from it. Um, but, uh, we just got back. We just came out. Okay, so I'll see you guys when we go to the gemstone. Okay, guys, we are now eating lunch for the third time here. And still is going insane. Still is going insane. Do you guys have butt chicken? No. Mm -hmm. Here's one here last time. Hi. It's lunchtime. Just in. You know what? This is going to get us. I don't know. He's weird. He feeds his stuffed animals. Okay, I don't. I I only feed the dog. That's all I do. They're getting away from me. You have Sprint, you can wait. Alright, 
there's me, there's me. They're in the car. Guys, we're gonna save this for later. Editing to do, including me. Yeah, he is. Naughty, naughty, See you guys when we do jump starting. What's up, guys? I'm back after lunch. <laughs> Still stop. It's really, really annoying. All right. Let's start talking, please. Um, we are really now going to the panning for gym. Um, for third time this year. No. Well, second, second time, this, second this time year. this year. So second time at Crystal Cave. Third time at Crystal Cave. Well, no, gems is second time. Yeah, that, I I was being specific about what they are. The gems, second time. For the fossils. Last we, year. Yeah, last year we, that we did not really like. I mean, I like finding them. It's kind of cool, but. You like it? Oh, yeah. Are you going to use it? Yeah. Yeah. Then I do. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
Okay guys, well, now that we have our gemstone thing, Let's see. So that we have now that we have this. Now we're gonna start off a little. That's new. I've never had that before. Yeah, I've seen that before. I've never, I, I never had that. You never got it. It was really summarized. I've seen that. Okay, we're going to have that done. Now we're going to go for a second load. Okay, we have that. That was a quick one. Woo! The food's good. Okay. Second load. A little bit more from the last time we did. Oh, okay. Only. Ooh. Little, uh, there's a. I swear there's new ones. Look at that. That's cool. It has a shine to it. Okay. And that's not the cave spider too. It must have came on me during the cave. What? The cave spider must have got on me. What? One just literally fell from my hair. Oh. I don't know all the, I don't know other places where it would be. Here's like my hair. I don't know if there's any more. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Or came out of my ear. I don't know. Huh? Or came out of my ear. Ooh, that's a rock. Okay, um, ah, I think we just lost the big one. This is a big room. Oh my god. Ooh. We got some more, we got some more amethyst. We're stepping that way. Oh, we have got a few good. We're still throwing this stuff in. What? 
I got it out. No, Riley. When did he jump in there? He jumped out. Two guns. Is it a really small one? No, it wasn't. No, I got all of them, so. It's one gun. They were right there. Okay, so now we have the rest of our thing. I think I got the emerald. I got it though. That is emerald. Yeah, looks like an emerald. This is everyone? And it was green. And sparkling. It could be a deep green. Yeah. It could it's be a light green. green. Yeah. Light green would be kind of um turned off. Showed up. Oh, this is a good one. Okay, well, that's all for being with Jen with me. And now, we got a whole collection of them. Um, we'll wash it off when I get home, back to my dad's. My good dumpling. Okay, well... I don't know about you, but I think I just got a successful recording. Because, um, no our ice cream. Chocolate, no, not cookies and cream. So, what'd you get again? Why are you talking to me? Hey guys, um, well, um, we are now done with Crystal Cave. I got a mood ring. Right now the mood ring is showing purple, like a purplish, like a lightest purple. Or got, actually no, that's a dark purple. Which is relaxed, or lightest. No, it's purple. calm. It's calm? I'm calm? Okay, good, I'm calm. Um, this will be the end of, maybe it'll be the end of Gamma Week, I have no idea. But we'll see what happens tomorrow, Thursday. Yeah. Mini golfing, yeah. mini golfing tomorrow? Yeah, in the morning. In the morning, okay, so. Gamma, you're gonna have to record me when I do mini golf because I'm gonna be, you know, golfing. I'll bring my, can you bring uh, your, oh yeah, I can bring my tripod. Yeah. So I'll bring mine. So I can have it standing up when I'm going. Yeah. Okay, so get ready for tomorrow, guys. Mini golfing with. In arcade. Yeah, in arcade. The last time. Uh, don't know about the arcade. You said we would. Yeah, you did. Well, if we went to mini golf right there at the bowling yeah, alley. Yeah, but that one isn't a good one, and you said we would still do it because I okay, was. Well, mean. anyways. Um, tomorrow might be the last Gamma Week episode. I think we might do actually two months. Let's just do two more days, guys. Might as well. Um, thanks for watching. See you all tomorrow.